a punch in the gut for punch out gaming in Forest Lake. The small business broken into with thieves making off with thousands in Pokemon merchandise. That's our top story tonight. Good evening. I'm Karen Scullin. Surveillance video catches a thief busting into a small business, but the thief isn't after cash. He takes off with Pokemon cards. Fox 9's Mary McGuire with more on the crime and the price tag on the stolen goods that will likely surprise you. It's like a scene out of an Ocean's Eleven movie. A thief breaks into a store by busting down a wall. But in this case, they weren't after cash or jewelry. They were after Pokemon products. Pokemon's literally the hottest thing right now. For the last year and a half, everything Pokemon has been a huge hit with customers at Punch Out Gaming in Forest Lake. It says Pokemon on it, like I said, it sells. Early Thursday morning, trading cards and games were flying off the shelves, but not in a good way. They broke through the walls, crawled through, and took all the sealed product out of there. Caught on the gaming store's surveillance cameras, a thief broke into a vacant store next door, busted through the wall, and shimmied through the hole. At one point, they noticed the cameras. Tries to rip it off, unsuccessful, and then he puts tape over it, which he took his gloves off and put fingerprints on the tape. Over the course of about two hours, they emptied two entire storage rooms full of Pokemon products, never opening the door that would have tripped the alarm system. I did inventory on it and it was over 250K worth of Pokemon product. He must have had help because there was a lot of boxes. Johnson opened Punch Out Gaming eight years ago with his twin brother. I realized like how much money and product and time we put into it and I, I just started crying. I'm like, I can't recover this product because our distributors don't have any. So even with insurance money, that doesn't do us any good. This theft has been a big hit to the small family owned store. I would love to see the guy caught for sure. Can't do this to small businesses. Forest Lake police are now investigating and call the man in the surveillance video a person of interest that detectives definitely want to talk to. Reporting in Forest Lake, Mary McGuire, Fox 9.